Hello and welcome back to my channel. So today we are actually gonna go on a fun little adventure. I'm gonna show you guys where I grew up. I'm gonna show you my childhood home and it's about 25 to 30 minutes away from where I currently live right now. So let's get this drive started. It is hot as hell out here, oh my gosh. I'm like so thankful for this weather, but I'm also sweating in this like hoodie and sweatpant outfit I have on right now. Um, anyways, I wanted to show you guys where I came from and what my childhood home looked like. Honestly, I lived here up until I was 19 years old and that was my first year of college. And then after that, my mom and stepdad um, moved into a house in Clinton Township. So that's currently where I am living right now. And uh, I didn't want to show you guys this for sympathy. Um, I just honestly wanted to be more open with you guys. I wanted to share where I came from. And everything that I currently have in my life is because of hard work. Um, I'm not a trust fund baby. I don't have parents that are just loaded with money or that are giving me money. As you guys know, I've been paying off my student debt, which I'm thankfully almost done with. And uh, my journey has not been the easiest, but I'm not gonna sit here and say that other people don't have it worse than me. Like, to be honest with you, there's just nothing, there's actually nothing wrong with this house that I grew up in. There's nothing wrong with it at all. I actually loved living here and uh, you know, we had great neighbors, we had great friends, you know, here, and, uh, you know, my mom did the best that she could to provide, you know, for me, and uh, it just was a huge disappointment that, you know, I had a dad, and he never could sustain his jobs, so realistically, we were only living off of my mom's pay, and she was trying to put me in dance, and trying to, you know, have me have, like, this great quality life, and... Unfortunately, it she put herself in a lot of debt in doing so. So, I uh, I hope to repay her for all that she has done for me. Because uh, if it wasn't without her, or if it wasn't for her, I uh, I would not be I would not be me today. So, I am currently getting my car washed now because it is extremely filthy and it is such a beautiful day out today that. I literally need a car wash. Okay, so I was actually going to get in my car after the car wash and I was gonna tell you that how you take care of your car is how you take care of your life. So now I'm standing in my parents' bedroom and I wanted to film myself explaining my neighbors when I went to the house because I didn't wanna be rude and you know put the camera on their face. That's not appropriate, obviously. Um, but yeah, so I pull up to the house and I obviously saw like a car there, so I'm like, okay, someone lives there. It looks nothing like how we, like when we live there, like nothing, not the same. And then I noticed this guy, you know, across the street. Um, Dan and Cindy no longer live across the street. So this guy was walking out to his car. And I'm like thinking to myself, oh shit, you know, these people are going to think that I'm, you know, because they saw me with the camera. So I'm like, oh shit, they're going to think that I'm doing something that I'm not supposed to be, you know. So I like... You know, I rolled the window down and I was just like, hey, um, I used to live here. I lived here for 19 years and I said, I'm, you know, I'm not doing anything suspicious. I'm just here. I'm vlogging. I do, you know, YouTube now, blah, blah. And um, his name was George. So he introduced himself to me. So he goes, oh, yeah, yeah, cool. You know, blah, blah. But well, he was giving me looks. So then George is talking to me and he's telling me that he's having his whole drainage system worked on right now. And there was trucks there, blah, blah. And then the guy that lived in our house. He came outside, he looked mad, and then he's like, oh, yeah, yeah, it's all good, you know, she's just here, she, she lived here before, you know, so she's just filming, and he was just kind of like, you know, rude. And then the next door neighbor where Marilyn and Tom used to live, um, the guy actually 
was about to call the police. So he looked at the guy um, that lived in our house and he was like, hey, is everything going on? Do I need to call the 911? And oh then and the guy looked at, you know, looked at him that lived there and he was like, no, it's all good. She's just vlogging. She used to live there. Yeah. But I wish I would have gotten it like on camera, but I just didn't want to be rude and like bring it, you know. Oh, geez. Cause I like I wanted to shake their hand. I didn't want them to think that I was like, you know. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> also, my mom is not feeling well. Otherwise, I would film her because I know that you guys like her more than me. So send some prayers <laughs> her way because she doesn't feel very good right now. Good morning. It is now Friday, March 18th. I need to get ready for the gym. We are going out. To dinner tonight to celebrate my birthday. I need to pick up my pants that are getting hemmed. I'm also getting my hair done, so we need to get ready for the gym. <laughs> she feels better today. Yay! So she went to bed early, but I was relaxing and trying to, you know, enjoy myself. Um, these are my pajamas right here. Here, Miranda. These are my pajamas. And, uh, and I don't know if my bulk is just going crazy. Crotch. <laughs> yeah. Crotch area. And, um. Really, Miranda? Yeah, and my pajamas now have a hole in them. I got up yesterday, and all of a sudden, I was feeling a little breezy. <laughs> breezy. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys what I'm eating before the gym. So here I have my first form greens. Greens for gut health, reds for heart health. I always mix them together so that it tastes better. I have my fruit, two cups here. I have my Greek yogurt with some honey on top. Then I have my bagel, cinnamon raisin with spray butter. And then I have whipped cream cheese on this one. And then turkey sausage. All right guys, I wanted to show you my cute little fit today. Look how cute this is. I'm wearing flag, flag nor fail and just so you guys know, when one door closes, another one opens. <laughs> Alright, currently I'm at the gym and I have my first form concoction all in here ready for me to drink. So I have my ignition, which is carbs. I did only a half scoop because I know I'm going to have larger meals today. I did my megawatt. I did a scoop and a half because this workout only has 150 milligrams of caffeine. And I also did my Endura Formance. So this has beta and creatine in here, and this is not a pre-workout. So I also did a scoop of that as well, so I can get my daily dose of my creatine. So it's time to work out. All right, so I'm at the hair salon right now. I have like my eyeshadow and concealer on, that's about it, honestly. And Zach, I will introduce you to him as well. But he's gonna do my hair really quick for our dinner because if I don't like my hair, I will not, I will not want my picture taken, so. All right, let's go. All right, so this is Zach, you guys. Say hi. So yeah, he has been the one doing my hair for like the last, I believe like three years or so, and he helped fix my hair when it was super damaged, so I just trust him a lot, and you know, when you find a great hairstylist, you just gotta keep them around, you know? Okay, I am absolutely obsessed with my hair. So I chose like an all black look for tonight. I never go out. So this is the look and it's time to eat. Yeah. Cheers. Happy birthday. Yay! 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 Really for you, so we don't have any more like Look who crashed the party. Mom, shake it. <laughs> I know, we need to fix that. <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna lie, I did not film a closing clip after my birthday celebration. This YouTube video has a lot of emotions. I went to my childhood home, haven't seen it in years, and then also celebrated my birthday. Um, two polar opposite types of emotions and feelings. But, however, this is the end of this YouTube video. I hope you guys liked the clip. I hope you guys liked the video, and I can't wait for the next video.